Hey guys, it's Abby, and today I'm just going to show you guys a bunch of things that I've either purchased or that were sent to me. So we're going to do like a haul. You know, just a haul. I do have a Dollar Tree haul coming up, so look out for that. I got some really cute stuff at the, at the Dollar Tree, and I haven't been to the Dollar Tree since this whole pandemic. So I'm really excited to show you guys that stuff. But let's begin because I've got a lot of stuff and it's going to be a while. So get a drink, get a snack, do what you need to do to sit down and enjoy. Pop your earphones in, watch me while you do your dishes or cook. I have to cook dinner in about an hour, so I'm gonna try and get through this as fast as I can. I hope you guys are doing good. I've missed you, I haven't recorded in quite a while. I just got back from shopping, so let's go. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna show you is this pillow that was sent to me. So this is called the Sleep and Glow Pillow. It's actually like a really pricey pillow. It's like $150. I'll link it in my description box. The pillow looks like this, and it, it's kind of like a microfiber where you, your head just like sinks in. You're supposed to put your head right here and your face is supposed to be right here in the crevice so that like when you're sleeping, you don't get any wrinkles on your face. It says a beauty pillow. It says that the beauty pillow, it was developed by cosmetologists and orthopedists in Europe to fight those sleep wrinkles. The pillow's patented, 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 Signature design features side cradles, which helps it minimize skin twisting and folding. It has a silk pillowcase that comes, this pillowcase comes on it. And it has just a little zipper that you can use to take it off like normal. And it's very soft, it's very comfortable. My bed is actually made out of this material. So I'm used to sleeping on these. I use this pillow for about, I would say like two and a half weeks. And it's a really nice pillow. I don't really notice any sleep wrinkles like from any other fabric so I can't tell you if it actually takes those wrinkles away but it is nice to have like a little divot to put your face in so that way you can sleep nice and comfortable without the pillow being smushed against your face so I'm going to link this in my description box for you and this pillow is $159 it is very very expensive if I wasn't sent this for review i could never afford a pillow like this but i'm so glad to have tried an expensive pillow because i do like it this is what the box looks like when you get it in the mail and it shows how it works right here so all right so we got that oh i want to show you my mint mongoose for may it's actually really cute so I got this ring, and Mint Mongoose is a jewelry subscription. It is $12 a month, and you get three pieces of jewelry. It's not real sterling silver or anything like that, but I believe it's nickel-free. I've never had a reaction or like a ring rust on me or turn me green. And it is, and you can pick your preferences. You can pick if you like rose gold, gold, silver. And I really, really like this subscription. I do get it for a review. Here's the ring that was sent to me this month. And then I was also sent this really cute necklace. This is probably one of my favorite necklaces that they've sent so far. It's just these little cute white flowers that have like, like they're the little bells. I actually just planted bells in my garden. Um, they're silver bells, but they're white and silver on the inside. And it's really, really pretty. It ha It's adjustable, so you can make it shorter or longer. And then we also got a pair of the matching earrings to go with the necklace and I think this is a great subscription that you can get jewelry and you don't have to rent it it's not like you rent the jewelry you get to keep everything that you get and every month you just get a new set of jewelry so here are the cute little earrings and they're just like the necklace aren't they cute so they're just little hooks so we got that. I also got something from Derma E. Let me put this stuff here. I haven't tried it yet, but I do want to show it to you guys because I haven't um, I haven't used it yet because I wanted to show you guys what it looked like. So I got some PR from Derma E. It's right here. I really, really like Derma E. I love their skincare. It is so good. Right now I'm using their CBD skincare 
and I love it so much. This month they sent me Honest Natural Hair Care and it's clean, effective formulas enriched with plant-based ingredients, vitamins, and wholesome proteins, sulfate and paraben-free and safe for color-treated hair. So we got two sets. So we have the Scalp Relief Shampoo and Conditioner. So they're all natural, which I'm really excited to try these, especially for my daughter, Scarlett. She has a dry scalp like me. And um, so we got these, and then we also got a thickening, a hair thickening shampoo and conditioner. So this has the therapeutic mint and herbal blend, and it's supposed to help thicken up your hair. It's for thinning hair. So I'm gonna have my husband try these, not that he's like going bald or anything, but his hair's thinning now that we're getting older. So I'm gonna have him try this and see how he likes it, and I'll let you guys know in a future video. But if their shampoo and conditioner or anything like their skincare, it's gonna be really, really good. I also received some stuff from Pixie. I got a package from Pixie. I do get PR from Pixie Beauty, Pixie by Petra. And um, this month they sent me something that wasn't from their line. It is from Pop Beauty. Now it was a box that had three products in there because I had a card that came with it. But one of the products was missing, which was the, the spray, the mist. But I didn't get the mist because it didn't, I think, it looked like someone cut a hole in the box and like took it out, but um, I can't be sure. So I'm missing the spray, but I did get this. I got the Prismatic Pop Beauty, the Prismatic Pop, and it's by Pop Beauty. And it's beam up your favorite features and make your skin pop with Prismatic Perfection. This ultra light reflecting illuminator seamlessly blends onto the skin for an erythal, e e an eth an etheral finish. I have no idea, idea if that's right. Creating a multifaceted, three-dimensional luminous glow. So we got a highlighter, and this is in the shade Ultra Violet Light. I've never heard of this company before, but I did see that they have a Twitter. So I was really excited to um, start following them and see what they have coming out. So here's just simple packaging. It looks like a drugstore packaging, and then here is the highlighter. It's very pretty. And there it is on my finger. Um, I'll play with it and see how it is. Right now it's just a little chalky, but I mean, I've never heard of this company. It could be great. It's just a swatch, so I'll definitely try it and let you guys know. It'll be in a favorites video if I like it. And then they also sent me this eyeshadow palette, which I was really excited to see an eyeshadow palette because I do get a lot of the Pixie skincare, so when I got makeup, I was really excited. So this is the Pop Beauty Light Show Palette, the Dusk Deluxe. So here's the packaging. And here are the shades. It's so cool. We've got some glitters and we got some marbleized shadows and just, it's really, really pretty. I was really excited to see this. I don't know if my lights are making it look a little weird because it is glaring off the, the packaging, but let's swatch a few and see what they actually look like. So we have some glitter. So here are a few of the swatches. It's swatched fantastic. Like I didn't have to do like, you know, like a, a deep swatch. So I'm really excited to use this. Again, I'll use them and see if I like them and let you guys know in a future video. Really excited about that. Um, what else was sent to me? I think that might be it that was sent to me for PR, which I'm so grateful and thankful that I was even sent anything for PR. So, but not that I was like, oh, I think that's it. I just think that's all that I have in front of me right now. Now, the next things I'm gonna show you are stuff that I've purchased recently. So the first few things are gonna be from Walgreens. I picked up some of their wax melts, the complete home wax melts. I love the lemon sugar cookie. It is my absolute favorite scent of theirs. But I do like their sandalwood blend as well. It's like a musky, manly scent. If I can, I don't know how to say it any other way. It's just a very musky, woodsy scent, and I love it. I love it so much. So I got two of these. No, actually, I got three of them. I can't find the third one. It was get, you can buy three for $9. So that's what I did. Um, I also purchased the Real Techniques Miracle Complexion Sponge. I actually bought this from Walmart. I purchased a new comforter set for my daughter, and then I purchased a few other things. I don't remember what they were, but I also, oh no, I, I purchased puzzles. 
and um, to do with my daughter Dahlia because she loves to do puzzles with me. So I put this on the list and I got this as well. No, I didn't put it on the list. I purchased it and it came with the puzzles. So I got a Real Technique sponge. These are really good. They're my favorite sponges to use uh, from the drugstore. I think they're great. I also picked up a Total Face Sponge. You use wet or dry from e.l.f. I've never used the e.l.f. sponges. At least I don't think I did. Um, I don't remember using one, but I did want to just try it. I didn't want to stick my fingers in there and pull it out, but it does feel really nice. I like sponges that are like really like they feel like there's air inside, like lots of bubbles. I really like that. I don't mind if it picks up a ton of product. I just like the way it feels on my skin. And I also picked up my favorite foundation for right now. I was using Revlon's, but now I went back to Fit Me and I got the shade um, Nude Beige because I will start getting a tan soon. Um, I do have some color from working in the garden so much, so I wanted to get a deeper shade of foundation. What else? Oh, I found this adorable little Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. It's so, so cute. It was $5.99 and I just figured I'd pick it up and show you guys because this was at Walgreens and they don't sell Physicians Formula there, not that I know of. And I thought that this was so cute. And if you don't want to spend $17 on a bronzer, and if you're not like me and go crazy with bronzer, this might last you a little bit, but it's so adorable. If I can get it out, hold on. Look how cute it is. I've never seen a small butter bronzer from Physicians Formula. Physicians Formula has my favorite bronzer. I really, really love this bronzer. And it has a lovely scent. It smells like coconuts. So I was really excited to see a baby one because I've never seen it before. So I just had to buy it. The next thing is this. I got the NYX eye pencil in purple violet. I picked one of these up because I've been wearing different shades of eyeliner in my waterline and I don't have a purple. I really wanted to find a pink, but I'm kind of a little scared to put pink in my waterline because it might make my eyes look like I have pink eye. So I haven't bought one, but I did buy a purple one and it looks like this. It's just a pencil, like a wooden, it's just a wooden pencil, but I don't mind. I don't mind sharpening my eyeliners. And as long as it's nice and soft, which it is, um, I will definitely use it. It's kind of a little lighter than I thought it would be, but there we go. I think that would look really, really pretty in your waterline if you were doing like a black smoky eye or um, or a purple eye look, you know what I mean? I think this is really, really pretty. So the next few things that I purchased are again from, Wal from Walgreens, I think. And this is the Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Water, the all-in-one mattifying. I actually love using micellar water. I use micellar water with my makeup wipes because, um, I don't know, for some reason I feel like one makeup wipe without my cellar water is not gonna clean my face. So I put my cellar water on my makeup wipes and then I put it all over my face. It takes the makeup off faster, especially eye makeup. And then I also picked up the Garnier Micellar Makeup Towel Removers. I haven't used these yet. I usually use the Neutrogena, which are my favorite. So I got picked these up just to try them. I also picked up the Blushing Angel Whispers um, Glade Candles. These smell so, so good. These are some of my favorite scents. It's just, it's very floral and it's lovely. It's a lovely, lovely scent. I also like the color and I didn't see these in Walgreens before. So I picked up the two pack because I really love it. And that will burn in one day and be gone. The next thing I picked, I picked up is this. They didn't have my regular micro brow pencil from NYX. So I picked the fill and fluff. It's an amazing buffing brush by NYX. I use this shade Espresso, and they didn't have it in my micro brow pencil. So I picked one of these up because I'm running, I'm almost out of my micro brow pencil, 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 and I figured I can, um, you know, try this one. So it looked, this was, I think $10 and it looks like this. And it's a thicker brow pencil, which I don't really like, but I needed the color. So um, there's the shade right there. And the funky little brush. It's like a little baby oval makeup brush. So here we go.
All right, so we get, I got that. I'm, I'm not sure if I'll use the brush. I don't even have eyebrows. So I also picked up some socks. I love picking up socks from Walgreens. They always have the cutest socks. And this, these are no exception. These are by the company Reprieve, I think. And these are $3.99. I got some cactus socks, which are just so cute. And then I got some palm tree yellow socks and then just plain orange peach socks. So I really, really love getting socks from Walgreens. Most of my socks are from Walgreens. I love them. Okay, what else was I gonna show you guys? The socks? I think that was it. So the socks and then um, this. So this is the Melt Cosmetics Rust Palette. And it's supposedly really, really good like super good. So I'm very excited to use it and try it and enjoy it. Here it is. They're pretty, aren't they? I'm very excited about this. I, I don't want you guys seeing my dirty house right now. So I'm trying to hide the mirror. Um, my house is a mess and it always is. I have lots of animals and I have kids and I don't clean every day, all day. It just doesn't happen. All right. So I just, I really want to swatch this yellow. So there's that. I think I found out about Milk Cosmetics from Raw Beauty Christie, who I really enjoy watching. I really like her a lot. She's just real and open and honest and she doesn't ever try to be perfect. You know what I mean? So I just, I just really like her a lot. I really like Raw Beauty Christie. That's her name, right? Yeah. All right, so there's some swatches. We got them all over here. All the really good swatches, those are Milk Cosmetics. Um, I'm very excited to try this palette. The eyeshadows colors are right up my alley. Maybe not that yellow, but definitely something that I will grab for and I'm excited to try. So, all right guys, that is it for today. That is all the things that I've either received for PR, that I've purchased, that I've gotten in the mail. And I just wanted to share it with you guys. I also just wanted to kind of like hang out and talk. I haven't filmed in a while and I miss you guys. and. I don't have any boxes to show you, so I just wanted to share with you guys all of this stuff. Don't forget, I have a Dollar Tree video coming up. I got some really cool stuff, so look out for that. And that is it for today, guys. Thank you so much for being here. I love you guys so, so much. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.